Lucia asks, Hi Andreas, here are two vitally important questions. What's up with the emoji of the rat under the Bitcoin symbol and what is a ripcord blockchain? All right, first of all, the emoji of a rat under the Bitcoin symbol. Um, ironically, this is interpreted two different ways. The original interpretation that I wanted to have for that emoji is, comes from a talk I did about the security of the Bitcoin system. And I did this talk back in, I think, 2015 or 2016. And um, it's, it's part talk, part stand-up comedy. Uh, it's a bit of a comedy monologue. And it's called Bubble Boy and the Sewer Rat. Um, and I know you're probably thinking that is a very weird title. Um, and the talk is even weirder. But the basic concept here is that Bitcoin is secure, not because it is isolated from attacks like Bubble Boy, uh, but instead because it is constantly exposed to attacks and has evolved strong immune defenses against them like a sewer rat. So when I say Bitcoin is like a sewer rat, that's a compliment. But in order to get that, you have to watch the talk Bubble Boy and the Sewer Rat and understand what I mean. So Bitcoin is the sewer rat, and that's what's represented by that emoji. That's the cute little rat that um, is still not dead, despite all of the things that are trying to attack it, because it has such a strong immune system. Uh, and that's how decentralized systems work. Now, ironically, people flip that. Um, people say the banking system is a rat, and Bitcoin is the rat poison. And so Bitcoin represents the poison that takes down the rats that are the banks. Um, yeah, kind of. And so, well, listen, I'm not going to judge it. The emoji plays both ways. Um, you could put it on a t-shirt and then you can go around and people are like, oh, why do you have a rat and what's that B symbol above it? And then you can pick one of the two stories to run with in your explanation. The rat poison one is probably easier to explain than to go into a whole monologue about this weird Greek guy called Antonopoulos who did a talk called Bubble Boy and the Sewer Rat. They're going to lose you halfway through that first sentence sentence. Um, so in, in, in terms of good storytelling, go with the rat poison for the banks. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, like, and share. All my work is shared for free. So if you want to support it, join me on Patreon.